Hi guys, uh, Brian Otto here, and today I'm going to be talking to you about the new Ash skin that was discovered uh, a few days ago by uh, Taskinos. Um, Ash skip is literally what the name implies. It skips Ash, it skips the Ash fight. Uh, we won't even trigger the cutscene or anything. We're actually going to be able to walk completely around the fight. So first thing you're going to want to do for that is you're going to want to make sure you, are, you have Brute equipped, and you're going to need at least one titan dash so what we're gonna do is as soon as we get to this little ramp right here um, we're gonna dash off use flight and then if you watch my input overlay I'm gonna hold crouch and what that's gonna allow me to do is wedge myself up onto this pipe you cannot get onto the pipe unless you hold crouch let me make sure let me kill this tone so he doesn't mess with us or anything like that all right so here we go it's gonna be dash flight hold crouch and then you wedge yourself up on this pipe again you cannot get up on this pipe unless you hold crouch um, so go ahead and watch it over again if you want to see my inputs with that once you get up on the pipe we're gonna go right past this little ring here you just want to get uh, past this ring on the pipe and once we're past here now we're in the spot we want to be so we're gonna actually gonna disembark out of BT and we're gonna clip out of the map um, you can look this direction if you want you know if you like I mean I think it'd be but I like to look straight at the wall. So I'm going to look at the wall, disembark out of BT. My screen is going to look really crazy, and then we're going to get back inside BT, which is going to clip both of us outside the map. I think we'll be like on the other side of those pipes right there. So disembark, turn around, immediately reembark inside BT. Right, and now we see we were right there. Now we're all the way over here. So now, where do we go from here? Well, we want to land specifically on this pipe. Um, so we're going to go ahead and use flight land on the pipe. Now uh, you want to be pretty careful up here. Uh, the trigger for Ash Fight is everywhere up here. So I believe you can kind of walk on the other side of this little thing, whatever you want to call it, these supports, but I like to just walk along the pipe. You can got to be careful because you can, will sometimes get pushed by those. Um, as long as you don't fall off the pipe you're fine, you can usually correct that with a dash. So I'm going to come along here to these rocks and come around here to uh, that little invisible edge you see. So the reason this skip is important is because uh, Ash Fight is, as you can see I just kind of walked up here. You can just walk up, it's fine. As Ash Fight is, is very unpredictable, it's really random. Her AI can do lots of weird things. Um, this skip isn't faster than the fastest possible Ash Fight, uh, which is, you think you kill Ash in like three or four seconds, but it's faster than an average Ash Fight, if that makes sense. Um, so we're gonna come right here you'll see this kind of invisible or you'll see like this ledge right here we're gonna want to walk exactly along this because the trigger for ash fight i'm not even joking he was like right there so you're gonna have to do this a few times to find the sweet spot in between not falling off of here and not hitting uh the ash trigger so we're gonna walk along the edge here okay and then once we get about right here we've cleared uh th this that ash that trigger for ash fight is about right there so once we get about right here we're able to walk over to these rocks. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to walk straight over. Now I'm going to be aiming for, uh, I like to aim for like this section of this rock right here. Just kind of this area between like this, I think of them as stairs, kind of like this area in between the stairs here. So once I get to this rock, I'm going to boost once, I'm going to boost one more time and then hit an invisible wall. So it's going to be boost and then boost. So now, I've hit an invisible wall. I know the screen looks absolutely bonkers, but I'm actually standing on top of an invisible floor and I'm next to an invisible wall. So I'm gonna do the same thing we did to clip out of the map. I'm actually gonna clip through this invisible wall. So I'm going to disembark from ET and then reembark. And now, as you can see, the weird artifacting is gone. I've clipped both BT and I through the wall. You can't even see the dome anymore. So now uh, you can actually just, you can literally just walk across here. So I'm gonna walk across here. And once I get right here, I'm going to use flight again. Hold crouch, you get up on top, get to the top of the tunnel, and we're home free. Um, nothing really else you have to be careful of here. We're, literally, as soon as we get right there, we're going to hit the trigger for the next level. So um, give this some practice. It will take a little. It looks easy, but it will take a little while to learn. Um, just the positioning and stuff like that. If you do everything exactly as I did in this video, you should be good to go. So as you can see, we're going to hit the trigger here, and we're on to the next level. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this was helpful to you. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video.